for it. Subscribe to Fishing with Freddy. All right, brother. Subscribe right now. Alright guys, right here in this clip, I got to the lake, I think about the first cast out, no more than a second, I got a bite on, I'm just right here reeling it in, but it was a beautiful day, I was actually coming to the lake to just see if there was anything left over from the stock, very nice day as you could tell, sunny and probably like maybe about 80 degrees already it was like 7 20 7 30 when um i finally got set up threw it out and everything but uh this fish right here was my first fish on this fish right here was the only fish that i caught of the day i was only there for like four or five hours so it wasn't really much of a whole day that i spent there it was just a couple hours there to see what was left over, if there was anything in the lake. Um, I believe that there still is fish in that water. Just, they're very like what they want to bite on, like probably shrimp, mackerel. Um, a lot of the times it's with the wild hog. The wild hog that I was using was shad. So a lot of guys go out there using um, the cheese wild hog. And the blood wild hog too as well. But the cheese most likely has the most advantage. I've seen a lot of guys go out there with that wild hog cheese and pull out a lot of fish. But uh, as you can see right here, I'm going to be bringing in this fish. Good size, probably about like three and a half pounds, maybe less, maybe three. But um, all in all, it's a good day. All right, guys, just wanted to let you guys know what this video was about because I know the sound wasn't, how do I say, I lost the sound on this clip. So I did a voiceover for you guys that you guys know that what I was using, I was using shrimp and shad wild hog and uh, marshmallows as well. And uh, that's about it. So hope you guys enjoy this video and sorry if that it's so short. And we'll see you guys on the next one. All right, guys. God bless. All right, guys, very short video. I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, like I said, I was doing uh, about four to five hours there. 
I just went for the heck of it to see what I can get. Um, if you guys are going to plan to go to this lake, uh, most likely shrimp and wild hog cheese or shad would be the ticket with some marshmallows. Um, very good lake if you want to come out with the family. They have two parks. They have a camping ground. They have a store, a bait store inside there, a water park. So really nice. All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this little clip and this little video. And we'll see you guys on the next one.